All right, here we go. Question number eight from our calculus one, homework number one in WebAssign. They've given us a graph and it says use the given graph of F to state the value of each quantity if it exists. If an answer does not exist, enter D and E. So I'm going to scroll up so that we can see what's expected of us here. And I have also blown up this graph so that we can visually interpret what's going on and answer these limits. And I'm going to blow those limits up so that you can see those hopefully better. Starting off, we have the limit as x approaches 2 from the left of the function. So over here in our picture, this is where x is 2. We are approaching from the left, which means that we're on this piece of the graph. Okay, so watch what happens. As I come in close to two, I need to know what is the height I'm approaching. And I am approaching this dot, which is at a height of three. So we can see the limit as x approaches two from the left of this function is three. Next, they want the limit of the function as x approaches two from the right. And so now as we approach two from the right, we can see that we're gonna be on this part of the graph. And if you watch what happens as we ride this graph in close to two, we can see that we're approaching a height of one. So we can say the limit as x approaches two from the right of the function is one. And since the limit from each side of f of x as x approaches 2 do not equal the same value, that means that the overall limit doesn't exist. Again, if you look at the picture, if I approach 2 from the left and the right, can you see that the two values do not approach the same height? We approach 3 from the left, we approach 1 from the right, and so the limit overall as x approaches 2 doesn't exist. And remember they said to input d in e if the limit does not exist. Next, part d, they want us to calculate f of 2. f of 2 is the function value at 2. So when x is 2, we can see here is an open circle. So that's not going to be the y value. It's going to be up where there's a solid dot which is at a height of three. So we can see that f of two is three because that's where the function exists when x is two. Next, they want the limit as x approaches four of this function. Notice that they don't designate from the left or the right. And so what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna look at what happens as I approach four from both sides. As I come in from the left, I'm approaching a height of four, but as I come in from the right, I'm also approaching a height of four. And since the limit from both sides approaches the same value, then the limit not only exists, it is four. And for the last part, part f, they want us to calculate f of 4, which is the function value when x is 4. And if we go up, we can see that there's an open circle and no place actually where the graph exists. So since there's not a dot or a graph value where x is 4, then we would say that that doesn't exist. And one more time, remember we input D in E for a value that doesn't exist. And so the last thing we need to do is we need to submit our answers and see how we did. And it appears that we got the green check on all six parts. So that's gonna do it for this problem. If you have any questions or comments about anything covered in this video, please feel free to leave those in the comment section below, or you can text me. And thanks for watching.